have a. They, they just they they don't believe me. They gonna believe that they're wrong. So is that what you were around there arguing about? Yes. Wow. You feel me? Uh huh. Mm-hmm. Well, like I said, my mama said I was right. Y'all wrong. <laughs> I didn't say nothing. Mama, I'm right, though. I, you didn't give me time to say anything. Mama, I'm right. I'm not, I'm not, I didn't, but don't say that you're right and I didn't say you was right. Okay, well, I'm right. You okay, mama, well, right. well, what's, what, what are we talking about it for if you are already right? Because they don't believe me. They feel like okay, well, you're not allowed in church. Okay, so we already know that that's not true. Exactly. The church is for everybody. Exactly. The church is for everybody. If everybody is perfect, why do they need to go to church? The exactly. church is for us because we all sin. Exactly. So we go to get our to get ourselves recuperated and get ourselves together. And but you don't push nobody out of church because of a sin. There's it's no greater gay. sin. There's no greater sin. It's because they're gay. Because of that. If you gay and you steal. It's still, it's still sin. Cause who gotta take that up with God? Not us. Y'all gotta take that up with God. Yeah, it's not, it's God. not no, it's not, it's not a. Um, I said this yesterday. It's not a greater sin. There's no greater sin. Sin is sin, no matter what. There's no color on it. There's no big. There's no little. There's no cup. There's none of that. So it's so many words you're telling them. I'm right. Thank you. I plead my. What place. I'm saying is, come back here. I'm, well, I'm, <laughs> I mean, you walk. You came in here. You 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 got your my your mama, information, and you just don't. Um, my phone's gonna die, and just, just, I pay on two percent. So. Well, it's don't. Well, why are you coming here with your two percent? No, cause I just need you to let me know that I was right. Oh, that's what you wanted me to let you know. It's not. <clears throat> don't don't take it as I'm right. We trying to hear, we trying to hear you to add for argument. What's your hand for argument? Yeah, you don't. You can't push anybody out because they their their sin is not a sin that you agree with. But he, yeah, he you can't you can't push anyone out of because of that. But he don't. He don't. You know, he don't. Mama, you not listening. I'm listening, girl. He don't. He don't believe because he just feel like some people, some preachers, they what they be saying. It don't mean you know. It don't make sense or anything. I mean, it, it's to it's to each his own. Everybody's not going to believe, and you can't force that on them, exactly. and you can't even make nobody understand or uh, make them force them on what you know. Exactly. So you could tell people, and you leave it alone. Right. Whether they want to, whether they want to listen to it or do it or not, that's the way. That's the way the ball bounces. So your hand is ashy. Okay, because I don't. We don't want to hear about that. Guys, say y'all. I'm back. I'm back. You. Wow. Okay. Thank y'all for coming back. Um, share, share. I'm trying. I'm testing this page out. So y'all share. It's still me. It's still me. I'm just using my my business page just to um come back and just talk like what we was just talking about. Do our normal guys day stuff again. If you're new to guys day, welcome. Uh, we was on here a few minutes ago, but I had to answer a call, so I'm back now. Um, but um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, that's what we do is support, share each other's information, share each other's businesses, churches, events, nonprofit organizations. We share, we inspire, we encourage, we help with, by any means necessary, whatever way we can. If we don't know, we find the answer to get to help you with what you need. Share, y'all. I'm not in my normal page where I do my, um, and my daughter came here asking me questions in the middle of me. <laughs> sharing um so y'all give me just a second the music that you hear playing that you may hear playing in the background is not my music um but we just love to hear this music it's for entertainment purposes So I pray that something today helps you, but we always give God his credit first before we get started. So I'm going to go back and give God his credit again because it's never too much. You can never uh, 
give him too much credit because without him, we are absolutely nothing. And we just want to make sure that we give God heals first before anything. Um, so we thank the Lord for allowing us to come on here one more time, gather one more time and to praise and magnify his name and to um, lift him up and to discuss him, talk about him, put him, let people, other people know who God is. And we, again, we on God's day, we don't just talk about God, we talk about life marriage kids whatever relationships whatever we talk about everything on god's day and it's all out of to just to make us better people to inspire us to be better to encourage us to be better to do better um because we we already know that um it hurts nothing just for us to um try to do better or to to get better to get more information we don't know everything so by any means necessary we try to help each other out the best way that we can. Um, hold on just a second. I'm trying to make sure. I'm about to do it for my... Hold on, y'all. Because I'm about to change some stuff out. I'm going to have to go live from this page more often. <laughs> that way I can be more um, I can be more um, hands on with this page more than I normally am. Y'all give me just a second. Um, as I stated earlier, I pray that everyone's day is um, going well, that y'all are um, staying safe, and you're doing um, some great things. God is allowing you to just be on top of the dirt, and the dirt is not on top of you. Blessing. That's a blessing. Blessing. You woke up your beautiful eyes today. God gave you another chance just to get it right, to get it straight, to make him smile even bigger because you're doing some great things and God is proud of you. He's, uh, let me see. He's proud of you. He's happy about what you're doing. There we go. Now give me a second. I was trying to. Yeah. Um, so that's what we, you know, we just like to have a good time on God's day, enjoy each other, um, and just praise God, like really, really just like to just, and we're a family, we're a big family. We help each other out by any means necessary. We support each other share each other's information um we not only share each other's information we support if we can be there for that person um praying with them talking to them on the phone helping them by any means necessary hey god say whisperer um i'm trying this new page trying my page i'm not new page because this page been 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 out there um but i'm trying to um trying something different to see how it go so this is a test run with this page today <laughs> and it's gonna take a minute because i know people just like you she don't normally go live from this page i don't that's why i'm sharing and tagging y'all in it um because i normally do not um go live from this page so i wanted to try it out today and see how it would go and um preferably it goes well um so if y'all can share and um but yeah it's still me i'm just going for my business page instead as always y'all know if, if we give god credit like i did just a few minutes ago thanking him for waking us up even though it may be cloudy rainy cool i don't know what it is outside i haven't been out there but whatever way it is outside i'm grateful that i'm able to see today okay because he could have took me out while i was slumbering and sleeping on last night but i'm grateful that he thought enough of me little old me to hold on to me another day i'm grateful I'm, i told you last night bishop talked about um uh what have god done for you 
like I was I started out talking about how being thankful for what God being thankful for wherever you are wherever like because it's a lot of people that's making arrangements for somebody but we not making arrangements we still here we on top of the dirt they not putting dirt on top of you listen they not picking out what color casket you gonna be laying in or what what you gonna wear or how your hair or your makeup or whatever it's gonna be that's not a, that's not what's happening to you today you here and you getting yourself dressed to go somewhere or to go sit in front of the tv or to go sit on the couch whatever you doing it yourself. God kept you here one more time. And I'm going to give him praise. I'm going to thank him for that. Because I know he didn't have to do it. I'm glad he thought enough of it to keep on. I'm telling you, I get excited about it. When you say the little bit of things that God do for you, I get excited about it. If it's, I get excited for what he's doing in somebody else's life. Because you don't know how God can bless you through somebody else. By any means necessary, he can bless you through somebody else. We don't know. You don't know where your blessings is coming from. That's why you have to always treat people with kindness. Greet them with kindness. Be nice to people. There's no need to be rude, angry, upset with people. For what? Where is that going to get you? You getting your chest all tightened up. You got to go to the doctor and find out what's going on up there in your gathering. Because you just so, you so angry about things that you can't control. We want to control people. We want to control stuff. No. No, quit trying to control everything. Listen, just just stay. Hey, it's nice to just be peaceful. I had a, um, I did my blog last week on peace. It's it's okay to be peaceful. It's okay to say no. Oh, I'm not gonna do it. Don't let people call you and get you in no uproar. Don't let people call you and try to figure out what you're doing wrong and how you should be handling your business and it's not their business. Are you assisting me? Are you helping me? If it's not for constructive criticism to make it better. Then don't call me telling me why I haven't done something or why I ain't, I ain't done nothing. That, that's not your business. Like, you, you know, that's not your business. Some things we just, it's okay to tell people that's not none of your concern. That's none of your business. Like, this has nothing, nothing to do with you. And you can smile. You can be nice about it. You don't have to be mean or angry with them. Just tell people that's not, I don't have to do it your way. This is me and this is the way I want to do it. This is how I'm going to handle it. I don't have to get permission from you because the permission I got is from right up here. <laughs> you see that? You see that? I don't know which one you want to use. This, this right here. It's like, God, that's who I got it from. I get it from him. He give me what I need to be doing for whatever he gave. Whatever this is, he got me, this journey he got me on. He the one got me doing it. Not you. I don't need permission from you. I don't have to call you and ask you. I don't need to sign, give you no permission slip and let you sign it and send it back to me. I don't need you doing none of that. I don't need you doing none of that. Listen. All I need you to do is just, you know, if you don't like what I'm doing, you don't have to call. You don't have to look. You don't have to come by. All you have to do is just pray and pray that everything goes well. And if you got a prayer, you got one of those prayers that's going, you, it's not going, as Bishop say, it's not going to go past the ceiling. Don't even pray for me. Like, keep it, put it in your back pocket. Give that prayer to somebody else. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Um, it's cool. And I thank him for, for waking me up. Come on, Miss Felicia. Yes. For waking me up this morning. Listen. For relieving this pain in my knee today, I feel so much. That's the listen. That's a blessing. That's a blessing. Listen, because we don't know. That's what I'm saying. You don't know what life going to. You know the weather's about to change. And I know a lot of people um, say they have they have aches and pains when the weather changes. So my husband called me early and he was like, "Ooh, it's feeling nice outside. You can tell it's about to be winter. Winter's getting ready to set in." And I was like, "Oh, okay." So um, you can tell. You know, I know people, a lot of times they could tell when it's about to rain or whatever from that pain, but just to be relieved from pain. Listen, to be relieved from pain, God is an amazing God. He can just do, listen, like I said last week, he can have it raining at my house and then across the street, it could be just, it's just sun just shining out there and ain't nothing. And you just looking like, oh, so y'all going to get sun and we going to get rain? But that's the kind of God he is. He can he can do whatever he wants to whenever he get ready because he's sovereign. He's a sovereign God. Listen, he's when you can do whatever, you can be everywhere at the same time. He can do whatever he wants to whenever he get ready. Don't need nobody's permission. And the devil need permission from him. But he don't need permission from nobody to do what he want to do. He want to take us out right now, right then and there. He can do it because he has, he has the ability to do it. That's because he is God. That's the kind of person that he is. And why we, listen, why we get upset with him because he makes the decisions that he makes for us. God is, what he does, don't get mad at him for what he does. It's a reason for it. You don't know why God take you down this, this street. You be like, Lord, why you make me turn left? 
I'm supposed to be going straight, but you made me turn left because he got something this way for you to go forth. He got 